Hour is focused on your health and happiness at 604. If you buy bottled water, which let's face it, a lot of us do, you may want to double check the label. Or you might neither be healthy nor happy. Exactly. 14 brands are being recalled for E. coli contamination. Some of those brands available right here in Connecticut mm -hmm. at stores where we all shop. News H. Brian Spiros is live from Ansonia with more on this. Brian? Well, good morning, Jim and Marisol. Yeah, many of us have bottled water sitting right in our refrigerator. We drink it every day. And the bottled water that's part of this voluntary recall is being sold at many popular stores here in Connecticut. Now, as you guys just mentioned, 14 brands of bottled water altogether. Niagara Bottling says they weren't told there was evidence of E. coli bacteria in a spring source. The water in question was bottled at plants in Allentown in Hamburg, Pennsylvania between June 10th and 18th of this year. By the way, E. coli can cause headaches, severe neck stiffness, diarrhea, and nausea. It can also be dangerous for some people. The people you'd worry about most would be the very young, the very old, or anyone whose immune system has been suppressed, either by disease or by treatment. Now, the stores the water was sold at include Big Y and 7-Eleven, as well as Stop and Shop and ShopRite under the Acadia brand. Now, we also want to note that so far there have been no reports of people getting sick. You were asked to boil the water before use or get rid of it. You can also return it to the store where you bought it for a refund. Now, the other thing people are probably wondering, how do I tell if my bottled water is affected by this recall? Well, right on top of the bottle by the cap, you're going to see two rows of uh, lettering. You're going to look at the top one. If it starts with an A, that means it was bottled in Allentown. With an F, that means it was bottled in Hamburg. Now, the bottle I have here is A8. 8 is the production line, but then you want to look at the date. In this case, it would be June 6th of this year. So this water is not included in the recall. Again, you want to look for dates between June 10th and June 18th. Of course, we have much more information on our website. Just head on over to WTNH.com. We are reporting live this morning from Ansonia. Brian Spiros, News 8. All right.